Right, I'm just looking at this uh, tied to the division lead, but in the wild card, we are half a game out. So, uh, who knows, McLeod? Oh, we lost a couple games there. Oh, I do need to do that one because I lost some off my splitter. Yeah, I'm going to do it. than two miles south of the United States Capitol. Welcome to Nationals Park. Today, the finale of this three-game weekend set, it's the Miami Marlins and the Washington Nationals. Along with Chris Singleton, I'm John Chomby. So the Miami Marlins wow. are in position to sweep this three-game series with a win. So, Chris, what's their mindset heading into today? Yeah, looking to go three for three, Blue. They've already won the series, and now they can really leave their mark. It's all about having confidence, and that's what a team takes away from a sweep. So they're happy to win the series, but they'll really be riding high tomorrow with a win today. And we'll be back for the first pitch right after this. Just about to get started, and on the mound today, Paolo Espino. What do you have on him, Singy? A really good outing for him last time. Scattered two runs, was attacking hitters, getting ahead in the count. Great performance. We'll see if he can do it again in this one. We go to the bottom of the first. And now up for Washington, Alcides Escobar. Hey, no outs. No outs now. Here comes a pinch. And the slider just misses. That's a really good take right there. Slider down and in. Very difficult to get on the same plane and do anything with. Swings and misses. One and two. One and, two. and now the lefty. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. One away. Pretty nasty cutter right there. And you're seeing that pitch, that location that a lot more the these days. Basement. And you can see why. Big Very ball. difficult for hitters. Her I think the great game. Mariano Rivera can at least partially be credited for that. Thanks to the career he had with the cutter. It was just dominant. I tell you what, I felt like it was a moral victory. Right down the pipe right there. Play. So I can feel for the guy right there walking back to the dugout. One down, one down. One down, base is empty. Oof. Outside. Plays at one here. Here's a one one. No blue. No. Out to right. Garcia. Oh, As this oh, one sized up. That was going to be a little blooper. Batting third. The right field. As we take a look at the Nationals lineup. And no, no doubt no. a big factor in this series so far, Juan Soto. Well, he had a huge season offensively last year and truly earned that Silver Slugger Award in the National League. He's one of the best at his position, and he showed it from the offensive side. So, you turn the page of this season, man, he wants to continue that and get off to a great start this season. Here's Juan Soto. First pitch doesn't find the zone. Well, Juan Soto had a huge 2021 season, just one point shy. Now this ball is well hit. Oh crap! This one's got a chance. Ooh, oh, just died at the. And makes the catch. Ooh, at the warning and track, the brother. Gone in order. Scoreless that was crazy. Back in Washington D.C. Nelson Cruz. Here's the DH for Washington. The ageless. Boy, he didn't start his career until he's like 27 or 28. The pitch. And first offering is fouled off. And he started 23 or 22. We'll be talking about a Hall of Famer right now. 
Still got a chance though. Larry Bullard making the calls behind the plate for us in this one. Pretty good strike zone. Well reviewed by those we talked to around the league. Yeah, he's an umpire. He doesn't get a lot of looks from players. Maybe here and there once in a while, but he's appreciated back there. The pitch. And he chases that one. And one out now. That's about as nasty of a splitter as you'll come across, especially in terms of movement. I mean, that thing tumbles out of his hand and just drops off the table at the last moment. If he keeps it down, it's just so tough to put wood on. Here's Lane Thomas. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. Uh oh in the air right side he can't get there it's a base hit. there goes the perfect game he's been swinging it really well lately when you that pop a ball good. up like that he you waited on it. it to get you a knock too often but right there somehow he got it to drop in no inside out swing went the other way on inside pitch on first so we'll see if they try to get him into motion now here is not easy to do pitch swing and a miss looked off balance that time real ugly 0-1 swing right there as a pitcher got to be hunting for that strikeout keep him off balance send him back to the dugout and that one is lifted in the air and it's caught and there's good no running grab can't believe I missed my spot that bad on that pitch Hebert Ruiz digging in for the Nationals the switch hitter batting right Hey, two out. That hits the dirt. Ball one. Well, with the amount of pitches that can end up in the dirt, a good secondary lead doesn't have to get away from the catcher. But if you're anticipating based off the trajectory, get yourself into scoring position. Puts it oh, in the crap. Left center. Oh, he tried to. Dang it. Pitch was in and off the plate. So hard to do anything with the pitch in that location, but somehow we got the barrel to it and hit it well. Well, I'm due for a bad outing. Here's the third baseman, Michael Franco. And Boog, I'd say he's due. On the ground. Zips it across, and that is that. One pitch too late. So they pick up a run on two hits, no errors, and a man left. We played two full, all tied 1-1. Come on, guys. Back here at the ballpark, and now the first baseman, A. Ray Adrianza, and the pitch. The, national, the first baseman. And he grounds one to the right side. On the first, one gone. Bottom of the third inning. I know me hate pitching, but I really enjoy this game. Pitching that this that doing this. Uh. So digging in, Alcides Escobar. Not doing all the moments and all that crap. I don't care for, for the pitching there. And that's in there for strike one. Hey, one away, one away. And a pitch. Swing and a miss. He was I didn't even do that many pitching on the uh, minor league the, um, during the minor league season. He's down on strikes for the second time today. Oh, there he gets the slider in on his hands, and it just eats him off. You know, it's hard to get the bat around on a pitch like that in tight. You just feel like you're crowded on the inside part of the plate. Can't get any extension. That's what he definitely should have laid off of. Two down now. Dang. Tied up here in the early going. Hey, let's get him right here. You got it. Hmm. That was good. Well, the hitter's got his timing down for the breaking ball. If you're a pitcher, if you can get that fastball in on the hands, it's going to be very difficult for that hitter to get the barrel to it. Whoa, why was that down the pipe? 
makes the catch. And Jeez. Nothing doing for Washington. Score remains deadlocked at one. I thought I did good timing on that pitch, but uh, barely not. Well, we went the other way with that. See how he waited for that pitch? The big lefty turns, kicks, deals. Swing and a miss. And the count is 0-2. pitch. The only adjustment he needs to make is his target. If you aim at the outside corner, that slider's going to end up way off the plate. Perhaps look a little more down the middle, and you get it right where you want it. Hey, plays it first. Plays it first. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. One out in the bottom of the fourth. Definitely made him chase a little bit out of the zone right there. I don't think that's a strike if he takes it. Uh -oh. Pretty textbook pitching. Get ahead in the count. Get the guy in the box on his heels and then force him to chase your pitch where he doesn't have much of a chance to do any damage. And he's down 0-2 as he swings through it. Generally, second, third time through the lineup, you want to be able to lean on those secondary pitches and command... Right down the middle and he missed it. A hanging breaking pitch. Ooh, tied him up. Struck him out. Now two away. Two outs, bases empty. Next to hit for the Nats, Lane Thomas. Oh, Lane. First time. I remember the guy named Lane. Well, Lane was his middle name. First name was Harry. But he didn't like the name Harry. I asked him why. My name was Larry. Or, yeah, Larry. Wait. What did I say his name was again? Harry. Harry, yeah. I would say, hi, I'm Harry, but aren't we all? Nationals go quietly. Score remains tied 1 1. That's all. We'll get him next inning. We head to the bottom of the fifth. Here's the center fielder, Yadiel Hernandez. HLB. The center fielder. Good old HLB. To the pitch. That one misses, and that is ball one. Kicks and deals. And that one fouled off. Another splitter? And a 1 1. Oh. Up the middle, and there's a hit. So a runner aboard to start the inning. Well, the last 10 games or so have been anything but fun at the plate for him, so that one has to feel good. Just kept it simple, played Pepper with the middle of the infield and took it back where it came from. I was real late on that one. Nobody out, runner at first. Nobody out here, nobody. Swing and a miss, and one and one. A high fastball, particularly for young hitters, can be hard to lay off of because you see it so well at high level, but it's really hard to catch up and get that top hand to work on time. Right down the pipe. That's where I miss. Strikeout number seven. He came out of his mechanics there. Typically he likes to shoot the ball the other way, but that time, a little anxious. Like it was a. Down the third baseman. Yeah, well, early on that one. Huh? Yeah, a foul ball. And one down now, one down. It's the same speed. And a pitch. And that one missing one low.
Well, why don't I fish for a double play then? You want to pitch on the outside, that way he'll roll over on it. Hit a ground ball. Next pitch is outside. Belt and fires. Ooh. Stays alive. And a pitch. And a swing and a miss. Back to back strikeouts. Well, interesting. He's looking very comfortable out of the stretch after giving up the leadoff the single. Baseman, back to back five. strikeouts. So hey, they haven't been able to move that Rock runner off, get him in the scoring position, and try to have a better chance of scoring. I tell you, good job so far hey. on the mound. He just needs one more out. Adrianza batting for the second time, and that's strike one. The pitch. Hey. There's the strike. Perhaps not quite ready to hit. First two pitches by him for a couple of strikes. Now back is against the wall. He's going to have to figure something out and figure it out quickly. Here's a one two. Oh, doctor. I missed my spot on that one, boys. A one two. And a ball evens the count. That one just misses, and it's three and two. Three, two, two out, runner on first. A lot of movement in the infield. Hitter's got to stay focused on the. Ooh, base hit. Hit hard, base hit. They stop the lead runner at second. Now two on with two outs. Alcides Escobar digging in for the Nationals. Escobar. In there, and it's 0 and 1. Two outs. Couple of base runners at first and second. Next offering is in for a strike. Quickly into an 0 2 count. Both pitches were down in the zone. I think you set your sights a little bit higher because you'll have a tendency to chase if you look down in that area. Swing and a miss. And he is down on strikes for the third straight at bat. So the Nats leave a pair. Still tied. One one. Another pitcher's duel. Back here in Nationals Park. Cesar Hernandez up to the Cesar plate. Hernandez. Be the top of the order here. You want to get it on. See if you can get a stolen base. Maybe get around the bases and pick up a run. Oh, a strikeout for the third out. to kick the pitch there's a strike of the knees and that's strike one when a guy's throwing a lot of first pitch strikes as a hitter you got to be ready to hit now that's not going to help you get deep into his pitch count and into the bullpen but you got to take what he's offering that day makes the catch and there's one gone Juan Soto down the right fielder Juan First pitch, and that's in for a strike. It really looks like these hitters have been in between with their timing today. Good fastball, excellent slider, but they've not been able to Ooh. commit to one velocity and stay there. That was a nice bid right there to try to tie up this ball game. Just couldn't keep it from bending foul. He looked locked in on that swing. Pitcher better be careful with him right now. Swag and a miss. The velocity blasted it right past him. Chris, third time through the order and a couple of quick outs for the starter. Yeah, he's been very frugal today. Economical with the pitch count. Here's some real power at the plate. Nelson Cruz. Uh-oh. Oh. Well, I messed up this. And 
the double puts the tying run in scoring position with two away. Drove that ball nicely, put a great swing on it. And it oh, I did. Oh, okay. I thought I failed the thing. Maybe I didn't. Holy. And on second, two down. That's in there. That is strike two. Well, Lane's good to be your night of mine. And he swung at it. Yes. In time, the two three strikeout ends the inning. So one left for Washington, and they trail it here two to one. in Washington, D.C. And now the center fielder, Yadiel Hernandez. For the Nationals. Well, after putting up a nice fielder. inning on offense, got yeah. some runs across, this is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just yeah, hope that he can right get here. through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. Left-hand hitter waits. Hey. In this situation, you expect the batters to be a little more patient, possibly take until they get a strike. With that, you don't want to miss your opportunity to get ahead early in the count. He didn't right there. Garcia has a beat on it. Puts the squeeze on it. That was a hanger. Maybe caught that one off the end just a little bit. Couldn't yep. really barrel it up enough to really drive it. Up next for Washington, the catcher, Kaber. And now it's Kiebert Ruiz, one for two. Hit to right. Wow. And it gets into the corner, but it's foul. Why do you keep wanting me to throw my the wind of the pitch? Swing and a ball popped up. And there's two down. Well, they're not crushing it. Here's the third baseman. Mike but I have no idea where that pitch is going. That one's in there, 0 1. You now, this manager knows that his players are just trying to do too much. Everybody needs to just take a deep breath, relax, and let it naturally happen. The other way, Chisholm. The throw to first. And that is the third out of the inning. Three up. Three down for Washington. And welcome back. On to the bottom of the eighth. And here's the first baseman, A. Ray Adrianza. The pitch. There's a strike. You know what? Maybe we should go. Ooh, Hall of Fame. We'll, we'll just do that. Because I think I'm already on Hall of Fame. Yeah, I'm already on Hall of Fame. Not from pitching, though, from hitting. And yeah, there's a foul ball. The wind of the pitch. And down on strikes he goes and one away. But it shouldn't I don't think it takes an effect till next so game. The next lineup turns over. And now up for Washington, Alcides Escobar. I could be wrong though. Hey, we got one here. First pitch and he just misses. Hey, we go. And now the lefty. There we go. And misses. Two balls, no strikes. pitch whoa base knock center field so a man aboard now with one away out here laboring been a pretty rough game at the plate for him so far a bunch of strikeouts so that felt good i'm sure that pretty much split the zone down the middle and those are the ones where you've got to make them pay and you can feel this crowd waking up a bit here as the guys are starting to make some noise with their bats Hernandez in the box here lets that one go for a ball. The 
pitch. There's the strike up high. And the count even at one. Now these guys definitely looking for a big swing of the bat right here. Try to close that gap. But, you know, at the very least, if you could find a way to manufacture that run from first, it feels like it's really important to getting back into this ballgame. Oh, I was way early. And it's two and two. Escobar, the runner at first with one gone in the inning. Got him looking. And two away now. And at first. And now it's one soda. One freaking soda. It's own one. Well, they say it's the best pitch in baseball. Strike one. You get ahead on a good hitter as well. He's a little bit more confidence to move through the at bat. The old one is out. It's late. It's a ball and a strike. And had a bad angle. That clips the corner. Another bad angle, but it worked. It worked for me, boys. Here comes the pitch. Bounced up the middle. Oh. oh, that got him on the mound. Safe at first, and now we'll check on the lefty. Hope he's all right. Oh, crap. Here comes the manager out of the dugout, and he'll make a move for the bullpen. Frank Tanana gives way. We'll be back in a minute with a new arm on the mound. Struck him out. But there, Gummit couldn't get the still reach base. For the Marlins, Anthony Bender. Tyron runs at the plate. And we'll see him once again. Come on, brother. Strike this. Ooh, 23 holds. Mega 24. Yes. Well, this is a nice sweep. Good way to finish this series. You're heading to another city for another one. Got to maintain the same focus. Whatever you were doing in this city. Make sure you're doing the same thing in the next one. Eat the same thing, sleep the same way, get to the ballpark at the same time. 4-1 the final here today. And the road team picks up the win and picks up a sweep. For Chris Singleton and our entire... 13 team, strikeouts. MLB wow. Seven hits I gave up, though. We'll see you soon. Miami Four runs on 11 hits. No errors. 100 pitches. Wow. Straight up. Admit it. Uh, I downplayed him too much. He's I can't stand boys. this guy. Uh, he's not Ferguson Jenkins. Uh, let's take it easy. But I get the idea that he's going to help us and he's going to be a major leaguer for a while. This is not a, you know, uh, a, a, a comet through the night. He's going to have a nice career and it's going to be for us. And we're going to win some ball games. Thank a you. nice I, career. I this is my first now, again, calm down. season. You know, we don't have a phenom on our hands. It's not even my first full season yet. Hard enough to produce them. We produce one. Thank goodness. Thank goodness. Can't stand that guy. All right, that's it for that one.